same objection. Then I'm going to sustain. Judge, it's going to come in through the it's going to come in through the defendants. It's a huge part of the statement. It's going to come in through the detective. The detective it's literally said it's going to come in through Daryl. Daryl is going to admit to it. Daryl was not present when uh, Ms. Kane went over to the apartment. He does not know the conversation that she had with the defendants, and I do not intend on introducing that to the detective. Well, he couldn't if he weren't there. He couldn't testify to that. So, but he's going to know that Jennifer left the apartment that morning. Jody's going to well, be able to testify to it. Brian so Greenwell can testify to it. You know, if they testified and they do, and then you've got that in closing. But, but it goes to the if. if effect on the listener, i.e. it goes to Jody and Brian's actions in going over to the apartment that morning. They went over there for a reason. Everyone knows what the reason is. There's you multiple can't, witnesses. Can't explain it without what, saying what she said. And just jump back and ask yeah, the first question. Is just, it, it, right now, it, I'm sustaining. Let's see how it comes in and, and close in. You can hone in on that. Sustained. Sustained so as to, what, as to what Jennifer said, right? Not the yeah. fact that she went over there. The mm -hmm. fact that she went over there is evidence that's coming in through at least three witnesses. That's not hearsay. That's a, right. That's, okay. Yeah, that's an action. That's not right. a statement. Yeah.